screencast recording will record directly from the screen, so PowerPoint slides, web pages or any other applications will all be recorded. You can use this method for both lecture and non-lecture based recording. First check that your microphone and webcam, if required, are plugged into your computer. Most webcams have built-in microphones, so you may not need a separate microphone. Before you record anything, you'll need to make the following settings. Once saved, many of the settings will be available the next time you open the recorder. First of all, you need to select the destination folder for your recordings in this drop-down box. Click on the Add New Session button next to your unit name. If you can't see your unit in the list, you'll need to refresh the list by logging into MyBU. Go to your unit and click on Panopto Video in the Unit menu. If your unit still doesn't show in the recorder, please contact your faculty learning technologist. Now you need to enter the name you're giving your recording. If you'd like to use a webcam, go to Video and select the device from the list. Select your microphone from the drop-down list in Audio. To make sure the level is correct, talk into the microphone and adjust the slider so that metre level is at the top of the green. You'll see the slider next to the webcam view. Set quality to Ultra and click Apply. Select the max resolution, bitrate and frame rate to the maximum settings and click Apply. Next, go to Capture Source which will probably be primary screen. If you're using PowerPoint slides, tick to capture PowerPoint as well. To start recording, click the red record button. To begin your presentation, minimize the recorder window. You can choose to pause or stop the recording simply by maximizing the recorder and selecting the appropriate button. Please note that once you've stopped the recording, the presentation will automatically upload to the Panopto server. And if the destination folder for the recording is linked to a MyBU unit, then it will be available as soon as the video has been uploaded and processed. This normally takes a few minutes. 